Training's been good so far. Um, we haven't exactly pushed ourselves to our limits yet, but in the following weeks, we should be doing that and hence get the results out of it come meet time. I think honestly training's gone very good. We have a uh, good number of guys came in this year as freshmen and they're really gonna help us, you know, motivate us to keep moving forward and get us better in our conference. Um, the new kids are actually great. Um, I've been here for a while, so from the past to now, um, they look like a really cool squad. They're really ready to be here. You know, they're very positive people. So I'm really happy that they're here. They work hard. You know, they're, they're great assets to our team. They come in with a great attitude compared to my freshman classes in previous years. Like the mindset is a lot different. So they work a lot harder. Um, Coach Enny, he just wants us to get stronger and he wants us to get better. He wants us to stay focused. He always wants us to stay positive. Um, he knows that this is a, uh, we have a lot of talent here. We also have a lot of potential. I think one of the biggest messages I've had so far from Coach is probably just uh, keep your head straight and think positive. You know, there tends to be a time where sometimes, you know, you can get hurt or injured or you're not doing well one day and you just put your head down and just but coach is always there just to say, you know, think you positive, sleep, uh, stay motivated, and everything will be better. We did lose a couple of core cross-country runners, but I think with the new guys and a couple of upperclassmen stepping up, it shouldn't be that much of a change. The leaders and the seniors that are left, it's like we're picking up where they left off, you know? It's no gap in where they left or anything like that. We're still just rolling, it's keep going and going. I think everybody's more, definitely more focused this year because uh, I realized last year we had a lot of opportunities. You know, we missed a lot of opportunities and now we're just trying to um, take that back and just keep moving forward. Um, right now, we're trying to get more into shape. Um, a lot of people don't come in in shape as they're supposed to be, so we're still all trying to get into shape. And um, cross country season is a really good time for us to really get in shape for track, so that's all we're trying to focus on. Well, my expectations for cross country this year is for our kids to get out there and compete and, conf and perform. I really don't like to go with saying, oh, you have to run this or you have to run that, but I'm say I, I would like to tell them that you know, as long as you run your best, your personal best, then that's what we're looking for. And mo mo uh, nine times out of 10, they end up doing it. I don't think I've ever had a kid here who ran and did not run their personal best. Well, I would like that most of our distance guys get under 30, but that's usually like their realm. They have to, they're gonna have to push each other. And then that a couple of quarter mile or 800 runners usually, you know, get into that mix a little bit. Try to get like under 33 minutes for the 8K course. If we just stay together, stay on the same path, um, stay in touch with each other, and know what we're really here for and what we want to do, I think we'll be perfect. We got to just be more encouraging to each other and practice, always running in groups, pick a buddy and just run together, and that's how we're going to get better. Because what you do in practice is what you do at the meet.